gonna be doing a short video about adding and subtracting with no sticks. Hi, my pants friends. I have a surprise for you. I'm gonna be doing my first book review, and the name and the name of the book is My Lost Dog Mojo. That's really sad. She lost her dog. Right. So what's her name? Her name is Suhalia B. Boston. And this is her what? Is it her first book? Yep, it's her first book. You guys know that we are too old for slimes, right? Sticks, you know, one, two, three, four, five. You know that takes all day. So, no more sticks, please. Add it. Adding, bringing two or more numbers or things together to make a new total. Here's a few word expressions to look for when adding. Write that down on your paper. All in, in all, sum, total, add, add, plus, more than, greater than. Alright guys, pay attention. Adding with no sticks. Put the larger number in your head and put the smaller number on your fingers. Then start with saying the larger number and count up the small number on your fingers. Alright guys, 7 plus 5. So, if I have, I have 5 on my fingers and 7 in my head, right? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12! Let's take away some sticks. Away, away, away. No more sticks, please. Let's do some subtracting. Subtracting to take one number, just one, or thing away from another. Here's a few word expressions to look for when subtracting. Left, difference, take away, shut your hand, sub subtract, less than, subtraction. No sticks allowed. So you got some three options. Let's do the Put the smaller number in your head and then count all the way forward to the larger number. Option number two, let's get started. Put the larger number on your hands and then take away the smaller number. Option number three, the last one. Let's get started. Put the larger number in your head and put the smaller number on your fingers. And then count down or backwards. Peace. All right, guys, here goes some examples for the options. So, if I put the smaller number in my head, uh -huh, and then I will count up to the larger number. Okay, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And my answer is what? Five. Let's do the next one, guys. Now, I'm gonna put the larger number in my head and then, I, and then when I put the larger number in my head, and then I'm gonna take away the, the number. Now, let's do that. All right, four in my head, and then if I have four, I take away two. What is that answer? Um, let's see, two. Option three, example three, guys. Let's get started. So, if I put the larger number in my head, right? Mm -hmm, my head, and then I count down. So, eight, seven, six, five. What was that? Five. Peace, guys. Okay. Hi, guys. Happy Black History Month. 
Do you guys know that I'm going to be doing my first book review? And the name of the book is called My Lost Dog Mojo. The book is about a little girl named Leslie and she lost her dog in New York City. Come on guys, let's read it. Alright guys, let's talk a little bit about the book. Alright guys, let's see this. What is this thing? All right. This is a heartwarming tale about a little girl named Leslie and her dog Mojo. Mojo gets lost in the big city, New York City. Will Leslie ever get Mojo back or will she lose him forever? Time will tell. Go get the book. Peace.